Welcome back, Bears. I'm Ren. Summer. I'm Jay. Robin. DJ. I'm Aiden. I'm Jacob. I'm Vladimir. I'm Hayes. I'm Nikos. I'm Grief. I'm Tunin. I'm Gabriel. I'm Henry. I'm D. I'm Diego. I'm Lanny. I'm James. I'm Marquis. I'm Zachary. I'm Brandon Bickhorst. I'm Lincoln. I'm Kyrie. I'm Uriah. I'm Daniel. Bears. I'm Annalise. We're recording from the BTC studio. Welcome back, Bears. I'm Mr. Cerner reporting from the BTV studio. Today is Friday, April 1st, and today is April Fool's Day, which has been celebrated for several centuries by different cultures, though its exact origins remain a mystery. Some historians speculate that April Fool's Day dates back to 1582, when France switched from the Julian calendar to the Gregorian calendar. The New Year had moved to January 1st, and those people <clears throat> who continued to celebrate it during the last week of March through April 1st became the butt of jokes and hoaxes. They were called April Fools and endured pranks on that day. Let's take a quick look at today in history. On April 1st, 1789, the first U.S. House of Representatives meeting in New York City reaches quorum and elected Pennsylvania Representative Frederick Muhlenberg as its first speaker. Now for more recent news. Last night, the Brennan Bears competed at NISD Meet 5 bringing home first place overall as a team in the GV, in the JV, sorry about that, in the JV and varsity teams. Sanai Thornton won both the 100 meter and 200 meter dash. Also for the Lady Bears, Kayla Lyons won in the 800 meter and the 400 meter runs, breaking her own record by running 57.66 seconds. And Gianna Stewart Burgess captured gold in the high jump at five feet, six inches. For the Bears, Armando Acevedo won the high jump by clearing six feet, eight inches. Arturo's got it done in the ring as well with Alex A.J. Ostegin, who now owns a school record in discus by throwing 145 feet, one and a half inches. And Gabe Bowen smashed his own school record with a throw of 55 feet, five inches. Way to throw, Bears. Congrats to all the Bears for a, night, a great night of track and field. Up next, our teams will compete in the 29-6A District Track and Field Meet, April 12th through 13th at Gus Stadium. BFND Bears and Lady Bears. Once more, here's a huge shout out to our very own avid teacher, Felipe Lopez, for earning NISD Teacher of the Year Honor Slap Wednesday night at the NISD Educators of the Year Ceremony. Congrats, Mr. Lopez. Every single grade level entails how to uh, enrich each grade level with college information, GPA information, how one year connects to the next, how to advance your time in college while at Brennan, so looking at course cards here at Brennan, looking at your college degree plans, your GPA, your freshman year. Your, GP, your uh, freshman year is kind of your transition year, so I definitely guide you in and then kind of grow you from that point. I can, you know, greatly express the gratitude that I feel get in this award because we have a lot of great teachers within this campus that I know do a lot more than I do. And this recognition is also celebrating their efforts in their classroom and I share this with them. And I'm humbly grateful for the experience and the recognition of how, you know, out of all I was chosen as this year's Teacher of the Year. Our Lady Bears soccer team, the area champs, face the Edinburgh Vela Lady Sabercats today at Cabana's Athletic Complex in Corpus Christi at 7 p.m. BFND ladies. Now into softball. Our Lady Bears defeated the Warren Lady Warriors 7-2 this past Tuesday. Isabella Hewn and Brianna Ramirez led the Lady Bears by each scoring twice. Gabriela Banda, Teorena Moreno, and Natalie Gonzalez each scored once. BFND ladies. Ariana Martinez, the winning pitcher, threw four strikeouts. Get on cheer our Lady Bears as they face the Stevens Lady Falcons next Tuesday at 7 p.m. at Northside Field 1. Also, this past Tuesday, our Bears baseball team lost 5-3 against the Marshall Rams. Today, our Bears take on the Harlem Hawks at 4.45 p.m. at Northside Field 1. BFND Bears. Now for golf news. Our Lady Bears golf team finished as district runner-ups for the second year in a row and are headed back to the regional tournament in McAllen. The Lady Bears had 
two individual medalists. Ana Gonzalez, who finished in the runner spot, second place overall, and Navea Figueroa in fifth place overall. Our Lady Bears will join our district champ, Cole Bowles, at the regional tournament this the week of April 18th. BFND Bears. Finally, Bears. Next week, start testing begins for English 1 EOC, which is on Tuesday, April 5th, and for English 2 EOC, it's Thursday, April 7th. For those taking the English 2 EOC, you need to make sure you take the exam because no makeup is available until next school year. Be sure to be on time. Testing begins right after the bell. This is all I have for today. And don't forget to follow us on Twitter at BTV Bears. And if you missed any part of this broadcast, catch us on YouTube by searching for BTV Bears. If you have any announcements for BTV, please email me, Mr. Cerna, at fernando.cerna at nisc.net. I'm Mr. Cerna, signing from BTV. Have a great day, Bears and continue to keep a positive mindset and remember to stay engaged in learning and continue to do well this final grading period. This is a BTV production.